Hi everyone, it's Ashley here from 15 Hats again, and this week we're gonna be talking about Gmail templates because I just discovered it, and let's be honest, it is a huge stinking time saver for me and my business, so I want to share it with the world in case it might save you some time. So if you're finding yourself writing these same emails on repeat over and over to either answer questions to clients or send proposals to clients or whatever it may be, then stay tuned because this is gonna be a time saver. <laughs> So the first thing you have to do is you actually have to enable the templates within Gmail and G Suite so that you can actually set up the template. So the first thing you're gonna do is come and click this little gear icon in the upper right hand corner and then settings. Then it will open up all the thousand and one different settings that you can do within Gmail and G Suite. So we're gonna go under advanced and then you're going to find the one that says templates and it will automatically say disable, but you're gonna wanna enable it and then click save changes. So this is now gonna give you that option to where you can actually create and save your templates. So now you will open up and compose a new email and this is where you're gonna write your actual template. So whatever it may be, I'm just gonna write gibberish down here. You will write um, whatever it is. You can include links here. So if you have links to specific things, like for me, when I send out um, new client emails or if I'm onboarding a new distributor into this business and teaching them how to run their business, I send out pretty much the same generic beginning email to them. So this just saves time there. Um, when I have a new client buy a new lipstick color, I send them the same how to remove and how to apply videos. So that's something that's in my template. So anything that you're pretty much writing over and over again to a client or if you're a fundraiser, um, anything that you're doing on a repeated basis, this is gonna be perfect to save you time in your day-to-day -day routine. So you will write whatever you want here. If you use attachments, you will have to still attach that to each email, but any links that you put in here will still populate with the template. So once you're done and you've written out your template and the subject line for your template, you'll click the three dots down here in the corner, then go to templates, save draft as template and save as new template. So you can name your template, whatever it is that you want. Just make sure you make it something that you know what the template actually is, especially if you're gonna have multiple templates within your Gmail. So we will save that and then you are done. So that's your template. So now next time you need to go to actually send the template, you can reply to any email with the template and you can also come and compose an email with the template. So to do that, you'll just click the three dots, templates, and then all your templates will be right here and you will just select which one it is that you want to use. So in this case, we'll pick ABC. So you'll have that and then you can type in the recipient's name if it's an original email. And if you're applying to a specific email, it would already be in that email. So you won't need to type in the recipient unless you're adding someone to the email chain. Otherwise, that's templates. It's going to make your life so much easier. Okay, so now you've seen how to actually set up and save your templates within Gmail and G Suite, it's the same thing. Uh, but I would love to know what things you're gonna use your Gmail and G Suite new templates for. Uh, I always find it intriguing to figure out what other businesses are using it for, but I would love to hear from you if you post it in the comments below. Otherwise, if you liked this video and want more tips and tricks like this, be sure to subscribe to our channel or follow us on our other platforms and I will see you in the next video. to set up your Gmail